the anointing of your life. There's an anointing for you to turn down that sin. Use it. Don't just, you know, you're being tempted. The enemy's doing it. Don't fight the enemy without the anointing of God. Amen. Without the power of God. Lord, I need your anointing. You know, you're being tempted. Lord, anoint me. There's an anointing to turn it away. There's an anointing to turn away from lust and turn away from pornography and turning away from pride and gossip. There's an anointing that you can do what you couldn't do without it. That's what it means. If you're just doing what you could do anyway, that's, there's, that's not the sign of God. If you're doing things now you never could, you know, you know, Mike had mentioned that people look at him and say, what? that's him. Well, people should be saying that to you. How is this person doing what they're doing? It's not by me. It's not by my. It's by him, the anointing. To be loving, to have joy. You may, whatever you're struggling with, I'm struggling with fear. There's an anointing to get over fear. There's an anointing to have joy when you couldn't have it. The key is moving. So don't worry about anybody else. You cannot compete with anybody else. I cannot compete with anybody else. But they can't compete with you either. They've got their calling. You've got your calling. You can't be them. They can't be you. It works well. And the anointing they have is not your anointing. And, you, and they don't have your and you don't have theirs. Your part is to be the best you that God called you to be. And only the anointing does it. Even Joshua. Joshua was told by, by God. He said, listen, he didn't say, hey, now you're going, to be, you're going to be the new Moses. He said, Moses is dead. But I will be with you. And you will enter the land. Be strong and have good courage. That means if you're walking in the anointing, you're going to do things and say, wow. Did you ever do that? Did you ever? Someone saw you and you spoke and you said, wow, how did that come out of my mouth? That wasn't me. How did that come out? That's the anointing. And it happens when you're in the will of God. You know, when we've gone to, particularly to other nations on mission trips, it's like, it's kind of like, you know how they say, forgive me, for, but you know how they, the, the, the Superman myth, he comes to earth and suddenly he becomes more powerful because he's in earth. Well, I've seen these people who were just like regular, and they went to these other countries, we're in the, and it's like the anointing just came upon them because we were just there to do God's will. And it was amazing what happened. Hi, I'm Jonathan Kahn. Thanks for checking out my YouTube channel. I hope you were blessed with the video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and tap the bell icon so you're notified every time a new video is posted. Feel free to share your reactions with your comments and how you were blessed. And share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching. See you next time.